This video will show you the electronic setup and software setup for the simple harmonic oscillation lab. First, you will of course need a laptop that has the capstone software. You will also need a GLX unit and its power supply, a motion sensor, and of course, a USB cable to connect. When you connect the GLX to the power supply, it should already come on by itself. And uh, if you connect the motion sensor, then it should recognize it on its display by showing a graph. When you open the PESCO software, if it's version 2.0, then click on classic templates and then check the first one. Add two columns using this button in this corner and set up the table as time, position, velocity, and acceleration. In the graph, select position on the vertical axis and it should recognize time in the horizontal axis. You will also need to go to data summary and under motion sensor, click on position, properties, and change the numerical format to three decimal places. This is very important to get measurements down to the millimeter accuracy. Do the same for velocity and acceleration. Mount the motion sensor on the lower scaffolding right underneath the hanging weight. Make sure the motion sensor is directly vertical and make sure that it is 25 to 30 centimeters away as to not get too close to the motion sensor uh, when the mass starts to oscillate. To start any oscillation of the mass, make sure you do it from underneath, gently pushing up a few centimeters and then just letting it go. You do not need to count down uh, to drop as the mass will oscillate for quite a while on its own. To keep recording, all you need to do is press the red record button. And if the mass is not misbehaving, you should see a nice sinusoidal curve for a while. 